Hi everyone, in this video we're asked if this infinite series converges or diverges, and then we're asked to find the sum if it actually does converge. So first of all, in order to determine whether it converges or diverges, we should find r. And so to find r, there's a bunch of ways to do it. Basically, all you do is you take any of these numbers, so let's, let's take the 1 half, and then you divide by the 1 before it. Obviously you can't take the 1, because <laughs> there's nothing before it, but let's do that. So it's 1 half over 1, which is just 1 half. That always works. Watch, let's try it a different way. Let's take 1 fourth and divide it by 1 half. So 1 fourth over 1 half. And when you take 1 fourth and you divide it by 1 half, you're really doing 1 fourth times the reciprocal of 1 half, so 2 over 1. So that's just going to be 1 half. So in any case, we get 1 half. Because r is less than 1, so the absolute value of r is less than 1, our series converges by what's called the geometric series, series test. So our series converges by the geometric series test. So uh, if you're being asked you know, why it converges, it's really important to specify the condition and to specify the name of the test and why. So, uh, and the result converges. So because the absolute value of R is less than one, R series converges by the geometric series test. It's, a, it's almost like a little mini proof. Very, very important. Okay, so now that we have R, uh, to find the sum, it's actually really easy. Whenever you have an infinite sum that's geometric and it converges and it's written in this way, the answer is always the first term. So one, and then you always just divide by 1 minus r. So 1 minus 1 half. So this is equal to 1 over. So 1 is really 2 halves. So 2 halves minus 1 half. So this is 1 over 1 half. And so 1 over 1 half is 1 times 2 over 1, which is equal to 2. Right, because division by 1 half is multiplication by the reciprocal. So it's always whatever is here. And then you'll always just divide by 1 minus r, always, every single time, as long as it converges. I hope this video has been helpful. That's it.